We feel like we won the lottery having both of them here. Hopefully they feel like they won the lottery as well. In the world of medicine, where long hours and grueling study time often leave little room for romance, Colt Burgess and Maggie Wilkins defied the odds. This couple's story begins here in Southwest Idaho, where both of them were raised. And here to tell us their story, Hector Mendoza. Hector, tell us about this couple. Well, Maggie is fresh-faced medical students. They uh, found themselves in the same class, and their shared passion for healing bridged the gap between strangers and soulmates. Colt Merges grew up in Parma. Which uh, some people know, others don't. It's, you know, on the western border, uh, about an hour west of Boise. I grew up ranching, uh, definitely in farming. I grew up on a small farm with my family. Maggie Wilkins in the city of Trees. I'm originally from Argentina, but I moved to the U.S. when I was really young, and I came straight to Boise from Argentina. With aspirations of becoming doctors, a love they found within themselves. Absolutely. 100%. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. For their own reasons. My dad was diagnosed with prostate cancer at a very early age. Our family definitely spent many months going to different hospitals within the Treasure Valley, getting introduced to the different, uh, the medical field in general, uh, kind of sparked my interest. I think it started with my mom. She worked in the medical field. She was a medical interpreter, and I would get to go to work with her every once in a while. Which led them down the path towards saving lives, and eventually, each other a perfect match. We met studying a yeah. lot during first year. We stumbled upon uh, an open study table and we're just like, hey, we've got this exam in a couple days. You want to go over something? With humble beginnings. Late nights with coffee and um, tea and, you know, writing things up on the whiteboard, studying, and then did a lot of uh, things together in our free time. A beautiful journey. We've done rotations in Alaska together. We've been in Seattle, Tacoma, uh, a lot in Idaho. We did uh, our family medicine rotation and we got to work alongside together and just really just keep growing in our love together for sure. Hopeful storybook ending. Two long lost puzzle pieces falling into place. He's just the best life partner I could ask for. But their careers had a match as well which wasn't easy. We had a list of 99 um, combinations. The odds were stacked against them. The what if a scenario that we would just kind of replay over and over, um, all while still doing rotations and trying to take care of patients and study for exams. We're not together for, coasts and... for three years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be yeah. Yeah, really sad, especially if you know, we just got married in May. So, you know, being newlyweds and then having to get the information that we, you know, we're gonna have to be apart for the next three years, you know, that's just the contingency you have to think about. Dr. Mo Hagman, a residency program director here in Boise for Internal Medicine, can speak on how hard it really is to end up matched in the ideal situation. We get approximately 900 applications for 11 positions. It's harder, of course, if there are two people trying to match into their top matches. I don't have uh, the actual statistics for how hard it is, but you can imagine for one, it's hard. For two, it's even harder. But even so, we knew we matched. We didn't know if it was together, what program, and we're like, okay, little victory. We know we have a job. <laughs> and then let's hope it's together. After months and months of waiting, another perfect fit. We got Boise. <laughs> was the best hug of relief ever. I was shaking so bad I couldn't even open my envelope. Um, but it, it was just a huge weight lifted off of our chest that we were gonna be together and in a place, in a program that we were thrilled to be at and be a part of. Love for both medicine and each other, leading them back home. I love being from Idaho. Idaho is my home. All the ranching, agricultural life um, that I grew up around. It's definitely a, a, a place that I love and uh, I hold uh, proud in my heart. According to the Association of American Medical Colleges, 60% of physicians end up practicing where they complete the residency. That's why Dr. Hadman says this match is a big deal because one, it's unbelievable that they both match the same residency. Two, the state gains two new physicians. And three, Colt and Maggie can start their married life together in the community they were raised. Maggie? It's just a win-win for all of us. Yeah. It really is, and we welcome them. We need great doctors here in the Treasure Valley. Thank you so much for bringing us that touching story, Hector, and we will be right back.